Well, hello everybody, Newborn Killer here, welcoming you back to another awesome episode of the Ocarina of Time Randomizer. Today, we're going to be talking about exactly how much of a failure <laughs> things turned out to be trying to go through the uh, Gerudo training grounds. It was not pretty. Not, <laughs> not pretty at all, actually. Quite, quite upsetting, if I'm being totally honest, but... Yes, that's beside the point. We have now found ourselves a way that we can... I'm gonna quick save up just because I'm not really... Okay, I don't normally do this, so... Right, so I realized when I was a child, I actually forgot to do this part. So what do we got here? It was the Zora Tunic. Okay, so now other than the hookshot, we actually have everything we... I'm gonna go ahead and save it. Oh, the game crashed. Well, that's why we quick save. So anyway, as I was saying, once we get into a more safer location... Actually, no, let's... Right, no, we can't pause. We can't pause the game. If we try to pause the game... Uh, the universe in Hyrule will explode. And we're going to be in a really bad place. But, yes, we got the blue tunic, so we should be able to do the water temple. Assuming we can ever get the hookshot. Um, a, you know, a small chance. Small chance. We can't pause, so we can't change boots! Oh, annoyance. Okay, so let's head into this little grotto. And then... Then hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to uh, pause in here. Okay, good to go. So we're looking at... Let's let's test the color. Ooh. Ooh, ooh that's not... Ooh, that's like... It's like a nice foresty green. Nice, nice. Not gonna lie, a little bit disappointed that it's not another shade of pink, but, uh, hey! That's beside the point. All right. We got two pinks and a... and a... and a... and a dull green. I mean, I guess that's an option, but any who's it's what. So we should be able to get over into the this area here, actually. Ooh, how do we do that? Can I do that with the hover boots? I don't remember. I don't think so. That seems like way too far. It's way too far. I wonder if we can just bypass this all together and just kind of go. Nope. All right, any who's it's what. That's why we have this bad boy on. So while we got the quick saves going on, save us some time, I'm thinking. Okay, we made it on that one. So, again, as all of you reminded me, we do have the ability to come in here and use our hover boots to cross this treacherous gap. Traitorous gap, even, if I'm being totally honest. I do believe there's some stuff back behind... Minueta Forest. So, once again... Once we get the hook shot, we have a lot of options that are going to open up to us. Because here's the thing: while we may need the bow for the for the temple that we just uh, the forest temple, the bow might it might be in the forest temple. All right, there is nothing over there that's good for us. I'm pretty sure there's no items there in general, but we can get into the, the fire temple here. We can't, but bear in mind, we can't pause the game. That's why I haven't taken the boots off just yet. But once we get in here, we will, of course, uh, be removing these silly, slippery shoes. Can you take fall damage in the hover boots? That's disappointing. Well, that's really disappointing. Okay. I, I guess it's fine, but it's still, it's a little disappointing, if I'm being totally honest. All right, get these boots off of my feet. Don't want them. We're shaping up pretty well for the area, though. I believe, actually, we could probably do... Once we get... Once we get the hook shot, we can actually probably take care of the... Hmm. It's all right. Once we get the hook shot, we could probably take care of the Shadow Temple, at least a chunk of it. All right, well... I cannot believe that I've actually fell foolishly into this hole. So yeah, as I said last um, last episode, we were going to try to do the uh, the Gerudo training area, but it turns out you need the hookshot for a lot of that area too, as you know as well, which is a bummer. But anywho, that's what. Yeah, you're releasing. Oh wow, Darunia. Ooh, he's in there fighting. Okay, give me whatever this is. Probably a key. All right, so that's of course going to open up the rest of the areas for us. 
I'm, 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 I'm really, really hope. I'm actually nervous, okay? If I'm being totally honest, I'm a bit nervous because I don't know where to go after this. Um, I've, I've been trying to keep up on the random, on the, you know, the tracker just as well as I can, but I'm human. So there's that. No, bats. Keys. Keys. You looking to lose your life? Eh, I didn't think so. Get away from me. Pretty sure we can't go this way just yet. We need the hammer. Oh, but if we can. Okay. Then we're going this way. Never mind. We're not going this way. I wonder if the keys... So, I think it's kind of interesting. There's a concept that... Maybe. Perhaps. Uh, sorry. Mildly interesting. Not really interesting at all. So don't get your hopes up for some interesting content here. But... The idea that while the keys are randomized, what if the keys were randomized randomly? As in, say you're supposed to get the key for that doorway originally, the original game, but now it looks as if you're getting the key to um, a different door, or intended for a different door. Of course, all the keys work in the same way. What I'm saying is, I think about some weird stuff, all right, and then my mind says them. It's not better, but that's how it is. Please give me the chest. Can this be like the hookshot or something? Oh, once we find the hookshot, God, so much stuff is going to open up. Alright, just another key. So, we're kind of just doing some necessary evils here, honestly. And, you know, like going through most of the fire temple and going through... Um... Yeah, I have the song of time. I'm embarrassed to say that I forgot the song of time. Alright, I remember it now. Remember. With my brain. I remember it. Please be God with you. So there should... I believe there's a Skulltola up here, if I'm not mistaken. Hoping. I think this is the Skulltola room. Yes, this is the Skulltola and Assault Room. Of course, I like doing this because I'm a stylish kind of guy who don't need no shield, even though I basically have my shield. Oh. Oh, I didn't know that was a thing. Eat this. All right, eat that. Yeah, go, go touch that. Don't you suck around me, young man. I'll give you the what fur. Oh wait, this is my last bomb. Why'd I do this? God, I'm an idiot. No, don't suck. No suck. Dude, you can't be just be sucking all over the place. So, not totally pointless to come in here. There is a gold skull tola, but otherwise, that's about it. Hold on, what 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 neat little thing are we gonna do with this one? Bruh. Link! I told you when you were a child, I'm telling you an adult, no one wants to see that, put it away. Alright. We don't need a link upskirt, I'm sure you can find plenty of that online. Bazinga. <laughs> but anyway. Yes. It's kind of weird how much, how little I actually remember about this temple, like... So the last time that I played through this was the... Super Mario 64 Ocarina of Time mod, so like things are naturally just a little bit different. Can I help you, Keith? Thank you very much. I, I really appreciate. Oh, having flashbacks to when I used my last bomb. Ah, uh. Okay, okay, it's fine. It's fine. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. Perhaps in the next room there will be ball. Perhaps in the next room, there'll be a giant middle finger that just sticks it right in my nose. I don't know which one is the case, and neither do you, okay? It's a mod. Anything could happen. I just had to do it. I, I had to do it. I couldn't help it. I couldn't help but pull out my last and final bomb. Wait a minute. We have bomb shoes. Leave me alone. I'm thinking. Now you're dead. Yeah, no, we, 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 we can still do this, assuming we have the ability to pause in this area. Let's go ahead and quick save just in case. But we should be able to let a... Just let a bomb shoot. Go ahead and explode in our hands and we'll be good to go. 
Got the six strats as always. You know, it takes us a little while to get there, but we do in fact have them. So this should work. Going to explore around this area. Be gentle. Easy mode. I actually don't remember what's in here. I think it's just another Goron with a key. Appears to be the case. Hello? Yes, I'm releasing you. Hmm. Mayhaps you will have useful clues that I ignored. Because they're useful clues for the base game. And I don't care about them. Alright, standard key, standard stuff. So we're good to go to the next area, but we're actually all of time for today. Thanks so much for watching all the way to the end. Thank you again. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. As I said a couple episodes, you are amazing. And I appreciate you on a personal level. Really, I do. If you're hearing this message, you're amazing. Just throwing that one out there. But anyway, let me know what you think of the series down below. I'm having a lot of fun, and I'm hoping I can continue it for a while. We're kind of running dry on things to do, but that only means... And once we actually find an item that we vitally need, it's going to be that much more exciting. So, anyway, I'm Newborn Keelik, and I will see you in the next one. I'm out.